the set list was the biggest challenge. That was the hardest, hardest part. Um, deciding how to maximize 13 minutes, but also celebrate. It, it, that's what the show's gonna be. It's gonna be a celebration of my catalog in, in the best way that we could have put it together. And you only have 13 minutes, that's a challenge. So you're trying to cram 17 years of work into 13 minutes, so it's, it's difficult. But we, you know, some songs we have to lose because of that, and, and, and that's gonna be okay. But I think we did a pretty good job at narrowing it down. Was there trial and error? You know, as you started rehearsals, were you running through set lists and re tweaking, realizing this didn't work in this moment? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. There, there are probably about 39 versions of the set list right now. Wow. Yeah. That's I think we're on to our 39. I mean, every little change counts. Mm -hmm. Whether I want, like, a guitar cut out, something muted, something added, or just put in a whole new song, or take out a whole song, like... Every time I make a change, something has to be updated. <laughs> That's a new version. Well, like you mentioned earlier, there are a lot of moving parts to the show, a lot of people involved. But another thing I've always admired about you, it seems like you know the right moment to step in and take control. And I think that's challenging for women. We're always nervous sometimes, me personally, of coming off too controlling or too bossy. But sometimes you know in your gut what the right thing is for you. So how much have you been really getting into all of the details of putting the show together? I'm, I'm definitely not one that's worried about coming off too bossy. I've been bossy all my life. Ever since I was a little girl, I promise you this, like, a hell of annoying too, but I, I, I know some people get irritated, but you know, the, it's writing on me, you know? There are a lot of people who are part of this show and, and a, a, a huge part of the reason why this show is gonna be as incredible as it is. And I couldn't have done it without them. But you know what? At the end of the day, if it flops or it flies, my name has to stand by that. And so I really get involved with every aspect of anything that I do, whether it's the Super Bowl, whether it's a makeup product, whether it's savage lingerie, like whatever I do, I'm that annoying girl who's gonna talk about everything. I wanna see the copy on the website. I wanna, I wanna name every lipstick that I make. Like I, I care about it, I love it, I love it. I really do. It all goes back to that little girl. I'm telling yeah. you from the report card. Little bossy big girl. It's really <laughs> amazing. Bossy is still here. <laughs>